situation and the hike in petroleum. We're on the street of Lagos to sample people's opinion on today's topic. My name is Kaliobi and I welcome you to People's Voice on iBrand TV. One to me it's still fair because the last time I had the is he is he the CBN governor or which I'm on the saying that uh, the cost of fuel landing in this country is 180 that uh, the government is still subsidizing and I know the gimme is all about lies and lies and lies. This country, the only alternative of this country, this country we are seeing, this our Nigeria, our so-called Nigeria, I call it so-called Nigeria, sorry to say, but that is what I call it. We need new change. We need a young, vibrant man. Not all these junky boys, so we need a very young, vibrant man that can push this country. But if we still remain with these so-called people, we are not going anywhere. I don't know. The reason why they are hacking the price, when we have refineries, even the one they take outside Nigeria is still there. But why? Why? Where the money make? What are they going to use it for? Is it for the benefit of the people or for sele for selected few? If all many major roads, even in Lagos that I know, they are bad. Money making by all these things, all these things. What are they using for? It's not necessary. It's uncalled for. In this time of economic hardship, even in the populace. It's uncomfortable. Our government are not doing the best thing at all. Like seriously, they are doing bad. Before they act the price, they carry people's people along. Then the stakeholder probably what the increase, the impact of the increase, because we the way government see things different from the way people see things. You understand? We can't just say okay, the price should be there. They know the best for them, but there should be communication. Okay, these are the reasons. If you don't do it, these are the implications. Do you understand? So when you make people realize the reason and they see the genuineness in what you're actually doing, our people will buy to it. Nothing is stable. And uh, when I was in school, it was 11 naira per liter. Then we were still shouting. Over some few years now, it has risen to 190. It's outrageous. It's preposterous. You can see this sporadic trend of increment. It's, it's unwelcomable. We just try to enjoy ourselves. You very it from the people on People's Voice on Ibrand TV today. And if you have comment for on today's topic, just come to the comment section and drop your comment so we can have a chat on today's topic. And please follow, like, and share on all our videos. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. So till I come here again on People's Voice, be good and love yourself. <laughs>